You're watching BTV. Today, electric vehicles account for a 2.5% share of new car sales. By the end of the decade, that number will grow to around 30%. To keep pace, we'll take a reliable supply of lithium-ion batteries. But this isn't a lithium story. It's about the second largest component of the lithium-iron batteries by weight, graphite. And according to the CEO of Gratomic, a soon-to-be graphite producer, the importance of graphite cannot be overstated. If there's no graphite today, there's no battery. Graphite is essentially what makes up the anode component of the battery, which uh, contributes to the storage capacity of the battery. But while the demand for graphite is increasing, there are concerns about supply. There is a shortage of quality high-grade natural graphite globally. It has been brought on um, primarily due to the fact that China has become a net importer of graphite due to environmental awareness within mainline China amongst miners. There's also declining production capacity from mines in Sri Lanka. So the timing couldn't be better for Gratomic's eco-friendly graphite project. The Alcon Graphite Project is a very rare vein graphite deposit, one of the only ones outside of Sri Lanka being developed in the world today. The key characteristic that makes Alcom's graphite ideal is the fact that it's coming out of the ground at a fairly high purity. It's already at the grade of which most mines would be at halfway through their processing circuit. The Alcom Graphite Project had been mined twice prior to Gratomic acquiring it. And now, even before a shovel is put in the ground, Gratomic will be producing graphite as soon as its processing plant is commissioned this year. We intend to start in phase one to mine historic stockpiles that were left on surface from historic mining. That should be sufficient for about two years of mining. Phase two contemplates to cut an open pit. We will be commencing that probably by the end of this year. Grutomic is focused on building a sustainable operation in an environmentally friendly manner so that we can leave a lasting legacy for future generations. Drilled intersections in and around historic mining operations has given management a sense of the graphite mineralization below surface. The company is currently in the process of finalizing its pre-economic assessment to determine the longevity of the operations. Mining operations are already fully licensed and permitted. Gratomic is aiming for 60% capacity by the end of the year. Last year, exports out of Sri Lanka equaled about 5,000 tons. Once we have the 20,000 ton per annum processing plant up and running, we will be the largest vein graphite producer on planet Earth. For now, Gratomic's main strategic focus is supplying the EV battery market. But Arno Brand's vision for the company extends much further up the value chain. We intend to vertically integrate slowly into the value chain, which is battery storage, where we're creating our very own gratomic graphite compounds that will essentially be the highest point we can achieve as a company into that value chain before becoming a manufacturer. The company is led by a management team that has worked on other interesting and profitable graphite projects. But Gratomic CEO thinks this one is special. The Outcome Graphite Project has the capability of surpassing all of our previous uh, achievements that we've contributed to the industry. Gratomic is also exploring their Buckingham Graphite Project in Quebec. Follow Gratomic on LinkedIn, Twitter, and Instagram, or visit gratomic.ca.